Dog's eyes thinks people are worthless. Well, I mean, this must be some kind of phrase, but it it feels like a phrase. Yes, I can't translate that. Well, it, it feels like a phrase by someone who's never had a pet dog, because that's the opposite of reality. <laughs> Hello, this is Y'all Weasel, this is Legend of Sword and Fairy 5 prequel. Here with me is DC, say hello. Hello! And I guess we're just gonna... I, I'm so shocked because I'm like actually moving around a large area with no cutscenes, almost. I'm, I'm actually like playing a video game. <laughs> Y'all Weasel cast death. Ooh, this isn't a very commonly seen pair move. Okay, that was extremely awesome, actually. <laughs> Victory. <laughs> that that was an interesting pair move because so if Shaho is contributing the ink, <laughs> that's that's his magic, he has inky magic, then then Xie was or Sha, sorry, was contributing the uh wind, even though she's not Wind, that's not her thing. I kept thinking she was wind talent, but her thing is earth. So I'm very, I'm very confused by how that's supposed to make sense. But just, it doesn't actually matter. Great, that doesn't have to make sense. No, <laughs> it, it really truly does not. <laughs> this is, by the way, like a, a beautifully modeled area. I, I love just the look of this place. It's, it's fantastic. I mean, it, you know, it, it looks of its era, let's let's be honest, but <laughs> of its era, it is a beautifully modeled modeled area. Yo, we'll cast death. Victory. Let us climb forever. Ooh, and look, the mountains, they breathe. <laughs> Here we see a time-lapse photo of pregnancy. A time lapse video of pregnancy. Got me to cast death. Victory! This is uh quite the climb. I'm shocked that Shaho hasn't passed out yet. You'd think he would uh, be on the floor gasping for air by now. <laughs> Creek Python said, don't forget to walk around after coming back from the Rainbow Islet. You might trigger some kind of secret mission. But do I want some kind of secret mission? <laughs> do I really? Oh, a pair move that's attack one? That's not even worth it. Victory, this symbol has mountain embedded into it, but isn't the symbol. I actually like the, uh... <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> Yes, yeah, so that's a fairy. Ah. Uh, ooh. Ooh. So fairies are humans who live in mountains? Oh, okay. So, sort of a, a pixie vibe there. Sorry, I'm just, I'm just getting a thumbnail scene here. <laughs> <laughs> wait, wait. There we go. Getting a thumbnail scene here. <laughs> Here, I'll get several thumbnail scenes. There we go. <laughs> Take your pick. <laughs> this is like the longest segment of gameplay I've had in quite a while here. I'm I'm stunned. I <laughs> I did not expect to actually yeah. be playing a video game for so very long. <laughs> Maybe I can just dodge you. You're not worth my time. Thank you. This is the character that has a K in the middle. <laughs> the character. So I like that this, uh... <laughs> oh, yes. That's a third... <laughs> from the third game. Nope, nope. Too, too much foreground tree. There we go. Now we got another thing. I was gonna say, I like this uh, music in this environment. Yeah. Thumbnail. <laughs> really, it's just that uh, I am, I am uh, patriotically bound to appreciate scenes with maples. 
<laughs> That's uh part of the uh uh test for uh permanent residence. <laughs> they they give you uh images, some of them have maples, some don't, and they ask you for what you prefer. <laughs> you gotta make the right choice. <laughs> <laughs> Or just scan your brain fMRI or something. <laughs> Level up. Okay, have I made it to the... Okay, yes, I've made it to the other part of the valley. So, what that hint was telling me to do is do not go directly here, because there's some stuff that's a side quest over in here or in here or somewhere. Uh, and what I'm going to do is beeline directly to uh, where I need to go to exit this area, because to hell with side quests. <laughs> Victory. Okay. So I should be able to walk over. Oh yeah, this sort of looked like it was going to be too rough of terrain for me to walk over, but as it turns out, no. It's more character from a previous video game. <laughs> Love me some character from a previous video game. Yeah, so the character K. <laughs> yeah, that's, again, <laughs> I'm recognizing it by the letter K in the middle, which is definitely what that is. <laughs> hmm, how do you ford this river? Oh, the, the monster just gave me a hint. Thank you. Oh, hi. Hey there, giant vi Is this... <laughs> Future Yaw Weasel, uh, bring back the first boss in this game? <laughs> Pretty similar, really. Not identical, but uh, kind of on the same wavelength. <laughs> Hello. Are, are you going to fight me? Or There we go. <laughs> That would have been devastating if you actually were the first boss in this game, but, uh, we've made some progress since then. Uh, you're still gonna take a lot of damage, though, aren't you? Hmm... So that's- its name is just Mang-Eating Plant. Ah, well, fair enough, it's an overgrown Venus flytrap. <laughs> I, I, I agree. I'm, I'm fine with that. This, uh, takes a lot of damage, huh? Sure seems to, uh, take a lot of damage. Okay, ow. Yep, that's an ow. Yeah, this is a mini boss. Okay, good to know. Um, this group attack is very damaging. Try to use water magic to freeze its arms. Oh. 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 Instead, I'm going to use pair attack because it happened to offer me one. <laughs> hmm. Oh, that's fire. This is water. No, this is water, that's fired. <laughs> I should remember those. That's interesting, because it's weak. It's... The... But that... That healed it, though, and didn't seem to freeze its right. arms, either. Yes. But... But that... But that healed it, though, and it didn't... What? <laughs> What? what? <laughs> yeah, it's very confusing. I don't know what it is about. <laughs> I think that thing just gets to live another day. <laughs> wow, it didn't even get give me the, you know, do you want to refight this boss thing? It's just, nope, <laughs> you're, you're out. Bye. But, but I did, but I did what the hint said, but I, 
but I did the thing that the hint said is the thing. I know. <laughs> but I, I, but, but I, I mean, I would, I would try again and like try to to do it right this time. Except, I did what the hint said, and it didn't, it didn't work. Oh, I think I actually do need to fight this. I doubt that I'm going to be able to sneak past it. Or it's a mini boss you can sneak past. Cool. Okay. <laughs> you weren't going to give me anything valuable anyways. So or hell with it. Uh, where's the actual Where can I actually make progress? Right here. So it's it's a totally optional mini boss that's incredibly difficult to beat, has a cryptic clue that doesn't actually work. Uh <laughs> and is just skippable. You don't actually need to fight it at all. You can just pretend like it's not even there. Okay, that all adds up. Sure, why not? I'm happy with that. You saw me! Okay. I mean, I... Well, I guess we're gonna get to see what Kaifeng looks like in this video game. Hooray! <laughs> I have found progress. We lost them. They walked so fast and uh, disappeared within a moment. Speaking of which, Kaifeng is much more crowded this time compared to last time when we were here. We were here before. <laughs> I was gonna say this looks familiar. <laughs> With so many people, it's much harder to find those two. Uh, Big Yan Lord, shall we report to the officials? Oh, this is here. Okay, got it. <laughs> Wangfu family is very has a is in a very good relationship with the officials. I think we can, we can just tell brother Huangfu and then he can report that to the officials. And this is where we visited the Huangfu family with their incredible livery. That's I, I remember now. <laughs> right, and we don't have much too much time here to waste. We still need to go back to the Shu Mountain and make the medicine. Uh, let's go to the Huangfu pal uh, residence now. Well, this beggar hasn't aged a day. <laughs> he sure looks identical. Well, okay, bye. <laughs> Roasted the dragon meat. <laughs> now, do I remember where I need to go? Well, it's it's definitely one of these two. It's this one. <laughs> Found it. <laughs> go ahead and save. Yeah, that's where your money was stolen by right. some random yeah, 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 yeah. pedestrian. What business do you have to visit uh, the Huangfu residence? We are looking for Huangfu Zhuo. The young master? Um, this gentleman here, what business do you have? I am talking to him. Why did he ignore me and start talking to Jing Xuan? Because ancient China! <laughs> or ancient essentially all cultures on earth. <laughs> Among us, only the young lord looks uh, luxurious. So they only talk to the rich people. Ah, it's not sexism. It's just that he's the one with a jade. 
，上次来石守门的那几个人怎么不在啊？不然我们早就进去了。Dog's eyes thinks people are worthless. Uh, last time, what happened to the guards last time? Otherwise, we would have gone in already. Dog's eyes think people are worthless. I mean, this must be some kind of phrase, but it it feels like a phrase. Yes, I can't translate that. Well, it, it feels like a phrase by someone who's never had a pet dog, because that's the opposite of reality. <laughs> it means they're snobs. <laughs> says no, no, it's people. someone's pet dog thinks other people are worthless. Mm, okay. <laughs> Right, so be, be, these are like the the lap dogs of a uh, Huangfu family, and so they think other people are right, worthless. Right, right, got it. Uh, please uh, report to the to Brother Huangfu and just say that Xia Hou Jinxuan is visiting. Xia Hou Jinxuan. Xia Hou Jinxuan. You are Xia Hou Jia's master. You are the young master of the Xia Hou family. Yes. Yes. Please wait a moment. This little boy, hearing the name of the little boy, his face looked so strange. Why was this young man's facial expression so strange after hearing your name? Maybe it has to do with the little brother's young. Maybe it has to do with the little brother's young. Xiao, that's <laughs> not need does not need translation. It's you, for real. Huangfu, brother, you how do you look? Huangfu, you look like exactly the same, down to the pixel. Yeah, I agree. <laughs> <laughs> Where did you go for this these years, or for these five years, and why did you not send any message? Young Lord, uh, Young Lord Huangfu, you should calm down. What do you mean by five years? You look exactly the same as before. So do you. They didn't oh, that's bother why the timer to update the model. <laughs> that's why the timer was... Oh my god, that could be intentional because the timer was going fast. <laughs> Dun dun dun. If we just left for a few, a short period of time, we just left for a few, a left for a few, a short period of time, how can we change very much? Is it you? Hmm. How it seems like you have you. It looks like you have changed a lot. <laughs> uh... I mean, come on, video game. If you're gonna make this such a major plot point, then at least like <laughs> add some some lines or something. He looks like he's molded out of clay. <laughs> you look uh, much more mature now. <laughs> and this is. Ah, Huangfu 兄，你或许没什么印象。谢兄也是当日护送我前往折剑山庄的护卫之一。Oh, maybe you forgot about him, but Brother Xie was once、uh, also a guard of of、uh, me who sent、uh, who escorted me to the Broken Sword Manor. And but that putting that aside, what do you mean by five years? <laughs> Always slow on the uptake, Xiaohu. <laughs>、uh, follow me、uh, inside, and we can discuss this. Uh, that day after you left out to the sea, you didn't send any、uh, message back. So Uncle Xiaohao sent all of their boats to look for you, but they couldn't find anything. Searched three months, but still didn't find you. 我想，就算你们遇到海难，若能及时召唤云来时，应也不至于遇难
After searching for more than three months, they still couldn't find you. Uh, but I think that even if you are in trouble, you can still summon the uh, cloud rock. So you shouldn't be in too much danger. We've got some lovely vases. We've got uh, some potted plants. Got uh, calligraphy stuff, uh, uh, scrolls to write on. A giant pile of rocks. Just just some rocks sitting here. Uh, more vases. <laughs> I'm confused. Is it a model of a particular mountain, or do they just have some rocks sitting there? <laughs> oh, no, uh, it's supposed to look like a miniature mountain, just like uh, it's a decoration. It's a very common decoration in old times. Oh, really? Huh. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, time passed, and you still didn't send back any messages. And uh, we lived like this for five years. Everyone thought you were dead in the sea. Uh, Uncle Xiaohou is very depressed afterwards. But it's been five years, so we got over it. Yeah. Father. <laughs> but it's unbelievable that you're still alive, and uh, your appearance haven't changed at all. After we left uh, the, for the sea and looking for the fairy realm, we only spent a, a few dozen days. Fairy realm, what kind of realm did you uh, encounter? So here's what happened after we uh, took the ship to the sea. He explained what happened. Look, I, I translated it before it even uh, <laughs> came on the screen. <laughs> yep. And that's what happened. I couldn't believe that the broken, the legend about the rotten ship is actually real. I don't know what that legend is. <laughs> but it's real. Oh? Uh, Illusion Queen in chat says the legend rotten of the what? Rotten Axe handle is a Chinese legend which has been compared to that of Rip Van Winkle, i.e. somebody slept for five years. Oh, she's just, just asking rotten what? Is he now going to explain the Oh, he's explaining the yeah. story. <laughs> <laughs> During the Jin Dynasty, which is actually the dynasty right after the Three Kingdoms, so re mm. maybe relevant. Uh, at that time, a man en entered the mountain to uh, cut uh, firewood, and he saw several children play uh, playing chess. So he stood and watched. After one game, he was he uh, wanted to leave the mountain. However, he realized that his uh, axe handle has rotten, and um, after he left the mountain, he realized that the uh, below the mountain time has passed by a hundred years. And that's when he realized that actually the mountain was a black hole. There's such uh, an event. <laughs> Y'all need to catch up on your general relativity. <laughs> One day in the heaven is a year in the human world. It looks like that fairy realm is actually not suitable for humans to stay. Luckily, we didn't spend too much time there. Otherwise, we don't know how many more years we're going to spend there. It's unbelievable that you had so much uh, strange uh, adventures, and luckily you're all safe. Well, we are the protagonists of a video game. <laughs> <laughs> and the two people you met in the Red Maple Valley, they are planning something in the Kaifeng city. 
Illusion Queen in chat says that uh, one of the Ice Horse, uh, uh, one of their dialogue is, you shouldn't stay here for long. As for why, you'll find out when you go back. Dun dun dun. Yes, that's why we were informing you here. According to your description, I think these two people belong to the sky cleansing religion. Sky cleansing religion? Yeah. <laughs> yep, <laughs> sorry. They established in the sky overthrowing peak, and they were growing in unthinkable speed. And they always they are they uh, specialize in recruiting people who are infected by demon air and uh, some demons. Mmm, it's all coming together now. Uh, for next time. Until then, thanks for watching. If you liked the video, join us on Discord at yallweasel.com slash Discord. Cheers from Yallweasel. Cheers.